Arnold, would you mind telling us what you're doing there? Well, um, you know, I, uh, well, uh, you know, Miss Garrett works so hard, I thought I'd help her and, uh, see you later. Hold it, hold it, Arnold. Now, your bed was wet again this morning, wasn't it? My bed? That bed? Not that bed. <laughs> that bed's so dry, it's dusty. Arnold, it was wet, wasn't it? Well, uh, you had it a tooth fairy. Mm -hmm. Maybe it was his cousin, the wet fairy. <laughs> Arnold, we know that it was wet. It was wet. I don't know how I could have got there. I didn't even drink water last night. Well, actually, you didn't wet it. Would you tell him about it? I wet your bed. <laughs> You wet my bed from down here? <laughs> That's right. I poured a glass of water on your bed. What'd you do that for? Isn't that what you did? <sighs> oh, I'm sorry. Does this mean everybody's gonna stop talking to me and playing with me again? <laughs> no, nobody's gonna stop talking to you and playing with you. That's good. Get bored talking to myself. But, Arnold, there is one thing that I want you to realize. Wanting more attention is perfectly normal. You know, bedwetting can be a real problem for some children, and it's nothing to play tricks with. I'll never do it again, Mr. D. I got the idea from reading one of your books. <laughs> Sorry I had to get even with you, Arnold. But you had it coming, so I gave it to you. Yeah, and you sure pulled it off. <laughs> <laughs> you think Mrs. Garrett knows about our little trick? No, no, she doesn't. Well, if you make my bed real fast, maybe she never will.